Hi guys and welcome to this tutorial. Basically I'm going to show you today how to convert your music from flat to mp3 um, or convert from whatever to mp3. I'm going to show you how to do it with your music today. For this you're going to need um, a program. You're going to need DB Power Amp. That's what I used to do it. It's so simple with this program. It's unbelievable. So I'll put a link in the description for where to get this from. The proper version uh, uh, place where to get this from anyway. If you want to get a pirated version, then download the torrent pirated version from somewhere, wherever you want. Um, but I'll put this link in the description where to get it from, the proper uh, place. Um, but it's up to you where you get it from, guys. And that's entirely up to you. But anyway, once you've got this, um, you'll have a few things. Uh, batch converter. I'm not sure if you get this with free version or whatever, so um, I'm going to show you everything. Um, just click on all your stuff in Batch Converter that you want to do, and click Convert. That'll open your converter up, and the list of files that you want to convert, and your settings, MP3 lane, um, converting 61 files to constant bit rate at 320. Yep. Um, or you can just use the converter itself. So, music converter, choose your files, click open, open, and that will bring you to the converter again. Or my personal favourite way is go into an album that I want to convert. I like all the files. So I like to do it one album at a time, so I know where I am. So I highlight all the files, right click, convert. MP3 lane, like I've just said, the 10 files, constant bit rate, uh, 320. Normal encoding in original folder and convert. Now that's converting them to MP3. Now I'll leave these files highlighted um, because when it's finished, I can just drag them flax out of that original folder. And then, then I'll just be left with the MP3s. So I'm just going to pause this while that um, converts them. So I'll be right back. Right, guys, I'm back, and that's just finished. So I'm just going to click finish. And see all these highlighted files that are flat, like I just said. They're the flat files, and the ones that aren't highlighted are MP3s that I've just done. So I'll just drag them out there, like so. And delete them. Like that. So now all I'm left with is the MP3s. But as you can see, there's no album art on them whatsoever. They're just blank MP3s. And I like mine to have album art on them. So when I transfer them to my phone or whatever, if I want them on the phone, then they've got the actual album art on them. So to do this, Basically, if you haven't got the album art, then you need to go to Google or wherever uh, to find it. Just type it in in images. And there it is. So I'll just grab that one. Save that. Like so. And then I'll open my Windows Media Player up, um, drag my MP3s into there, and they'll be in my Michael Jackson folder, there. Scroll down to it, there it is, just there. Um, and no album art, look, and then drag your album art over the top there. Oh. Album art can't be changed when a song from the album is in use. Don't know why it's in use, because I'm not playing them. But anyway. Drag it over again. That's it, do it this time. So right, now I've dragged that image on there. Refresh. And there you go. All album art is on the MP3s. So when you put them on your phone or wherever, you'll you'll have album art. So anyway guys, that's how 
you convert your music to MP3 from like flat or whatever, and that's how you put album art on as well on your MP3s. So anyway, take care. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial, and take care, everyone.